Greetings and salutations, folks. I'm Josh from Lazy Acres. Thank you for tuning in. We are saving the world here one trailer at a time today. We're going to take a look at a 2020 Sonic by Venture RV, model number 169VUD. It's got bunks in the back, outside kitchen, side slide, front windshield, weighing only 3,500 pounds. There's a whole lot of punch packed into this one. This one's been spending some time in the tanning bed, coming out, looking fresh. And I'm here with my friend, Brendan Hennemeyer on the camera today. Brendan. How's it going everyone? Thank you so much for tuning into the number one RV YouTube channel in the world. We are excited. This Sonic, amazing. I love how they got all this going on in this trailer at 3,500 pounds, especially with an outside kitchen. It's sweet. We got a sink in the bathroom. So many sweet pluses. You're going to enjoy this video. Hit the like, subscribe, all of it guys. <laughs> right on. Front power jack. And then your, ba your uh, propane tank is a single 20 pounder in behind here. Your battery in a box location is right through here. There's also a battery disconnect. There's also a solar panel on the roof for this particular one. Awesome. We talked about this windshield. This makes a huge difference on the inside, bringing nice natural light into the trailer. That's wicked. We have our storage in through here, right through the other side. It's a pass through. We got slam latch doors. All right, magnets holding those up. Four stabilizer jacks. One on each corner of the trailer. Fresh water fill, six gallon gas electric water heater. And then here's our slide, pulling our dinette off the floor. Good looking mudder tires here, eh, Brandon? These are Goodyear Wranglers. What size are these? 16s, my Man. goodness. Aluminum rims, that's fantastic. Let's throw those on the, the Gulf. Yes. Yeah. 30 anti-touchable style cord. Fridge vent, there's another fridge vent up on the roof there. Our sewer drains down here. Outside shower, city water connection, black water flush kit, and then you're going to store your sewer hose in your bumper. Around the back side, they didn't cheat out, Brennan, Ooh. and give you like a, like a white rim on the spare. It's a legit aluminum rim in through there, looking great. Backup camera prep right through here. Now, come down the door side. One thing we're going to see that makes a huge difference inside here is it, it's really, it's pretty short at the back. It's pretty short at the front, but it's got this arch front to back, which makes it feel huge inside, but still very aerodynamic. Two cubic foot electric fridge. Our Suburban griddles right here, we're literally cooking on this material. You got the eggs over here, you got the sausages over there. Shelf in through here. And then our electric awning covers our kitchen, which is awesome, goes all the way, covers our main door. Outside speakers, LED lights in the awning, kitchen window, lend hand grab handle, furnace vent, outside receptacle, outside cable hookup, Secure step all the way to the ground so you're not like hopping in and out. It doesn't feel like you're going off a diving board or nothing. Anything else you want to talk about on the outside, Brennan? No, Venture checked off all the boxes. All right, buddy. Let's have a look inside. Right now, folks, we're inside that Sonic 169. You're looking forward here. We got our RV Queen, 60 inches wide, 74 inches long. That's good then through there. We can get around the end of it, which is important. We've got that big front windshield we talked about, a big exit window right here with a screen so we can use that for ventilation. Shelf, shelf, DVD player here, TV there. It's on arm so we can have this come out, face the dinette a little more or great for viewing in the, in the, in the bed there. We've got hanging storage. We've got a USB on the one side and then a 110 receptacle over there on your left side. All right, coming out here, we've got our killer kitchen. So for a you know, 16 foot trailer, Brennan. Amazing. All right, two burner stove top. We've dropped the microwave down in through here, which gives us great upper storage. We've got drawers here, cupboards there, seamless countertops, undermount stainless steel sink. Look at the size of that sink though. They got the cutting board or the, uh, the sink cover right in through there. Love to see that. We got our kitchen window, I know Brandon. We've got the Venture RV cutting board in through here, which is awesome. We got the uh, the Venture just kind of branded into the trailer straight out of Yellowstone. And then, there we go, range hood vent. And then storage right here across the top, which is fantastic, all kinds of plates and cups. There's even a little bit of shelving up and through here. We got our bunks, these are good for 250 pounds each. Window, window. And don't forget we have our outside kitchen down below this secondary bunk and then our dinette 
So the way these guys do their dinette I think is better than almost anybody because when you turn this into a secondary bed, you're not using these cushions, you're just using one big cushion that's, that's shipped loose. So you don't have to you know, set up two different cushions, just one that slips right in nice and smooth. Plus the dinette cushions wrap around the backside of this wood here so they're not like falling off with Velcro all the time. We got storage there, storage here. You step up into the dinette, but it's definitely a four-seater dinette, you know, 16-foot trailer. All right, Brendan and I can sit beside here for sure. Nice window right here, sliding window, drop-down blind. Awesome possum. Look, oh, coming out. All right, we've got our six cubic foot gas electric fridge. And then check out our killer bathroom. All right. The dump truck fits, Brendan. There's no doubt about it. Stainless steel sink, storage down through there. There's no medicine cabinet, but there is a mirror. Everybody knows Josh loves mirrors. Up into the shower, I'm six feet tall. Yeah, I can stand up in here. It is tight, right? Like it's not like a, you know, a huge shower pan, but we got the curtain, we got the height, everything you need. That's the video, folks. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Hit the like button, the subscribe button. Have yourself a good day.